Hey guys, on today's video, we're gonna go on and download the latest update for your iPhone or iPad. So let's get started going into your settings. In your settings, all the way up here, you should see your name or your device's name. Make that backup on their iCloud. Now, if you don't have more space, go on and hook it up to your computer. And from there, use iTunes, for example, on your PC to make that backup. Also to update if you're having any issues. And on Mac, you guys can just go on and use Finder. Same thing, if you're having any issues, hook it up to your Mac make the update from there. Once you've done that, you should see software update here. However, let's say you don't. Scroll down, general, software update, second option, and then you should see this. If you don't, just turn on and off automatic updates. That should refresh things. And there you go. You can go on and update now. It's going to ask you for your passcode. Once you put in your passcode, it's just going to download the update. It's a really small update. And then it's going to install it. Just let it be. Make sure to hook it up to some electricity. Even if you have more than 50% of your battery, go on and hook it up. Just have it charging while it's doing this update and let it be. You do not need to be there to press anything. Once you come back, you're going to see an Apple logo loading bar. Restart again, and then you're going to be done with this awesome update. All right, so right after, you should have seen an Apple logo loading bar just for a second, and then it would have been done. It would have restarted by itself. So right now, you can go into settings and just make sure everything went OK. So general software update, and you should see that you're all up to date. That would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write them down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.